Welcome to Wellness Wednesdays, where I teach you how to live a healthier lifestyle. I'm Dr. Julio, and today I want to help you start. Start what? Start living, start breathing, and start enjoying. I want you to stop suffering, stop feeling alone. Hey moms, Mother's Day is coming up, I'm talking to you. A healthy lifestyle does not mean we all have to turn vegan. It doesn't mean we have to make a million changes overnight. A healthy lifestyle is something you have to want. It is something you have to strive for every day. It is something you have to work at and fight for. If you're willing to make that change, then listen to the rest of this video. If not, it's okay. Come back and listen to me when you're ready. For those well-doers who are ready, here's what I want you to do. Step one, have a plan. Without a well thought out plan, failure is likely to occur. Plan out your day and integrate proper nutrition, exercise, rest, and sleep into your day. Put it on your calendar, put it in your phone. Guess what, there's an app for that. My favorite is Calorie Counter and Diet Tracker. Step two, don't get overwhelmed. Figure out the one thing you want to change the most. Some of you may want to eat better, others exercise more. Whatever it is, for that one thing you want most to do, I want you to find help. Enough of this do-it-yourself mentality. I'm sure many of us are very knowledgeable on health and wellness, but all of us still have something to learn. Find a professional who knows more than you to help you meet your goal. Step three, make small changes. Health does not happen overnight. It takes time to make changes. Remember, this is a process of self-discovery. If your goal is to lose weight, set a goal of five pounds every two months. Small changes are easier to realize. If you would like to sleep better, start with one day a week and do all the right things to allow you to get a good night's sleep. The goal is to create good habits and learn about yourself along the way. Step four, reward yourself. Change is sometimes difficult. When you make the attempt to change for the better, you should pat yourself on the back. Whether you succeed or not, the fact that you're trying is worth the accolade. Buy yourself a new shirt, get a massage. The point is to pamper yourself because you're worth it and you've worked hard. The final step to your healthy lifestyle is step five, share your story. Don't feel like you need to make changes alone. Get a family member, a friend, or a coworker to make the change with you. You can help motivate each other and reward each other. If you decide to do it alone, then share your story. Tell someone close to you that what you're doing and what your goals are. The process of sharing this information helps you stick to your goals better. If any of you well doers need our help to get you started, you can email me or follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. I'm Dr. Julio, and remember to turn your illness to wellness.